Hello oh, there, Major Hill. Welcome back to E4. It is 1662, and we are fighting a war with Russia. Unfortunately, they did manage to tech up uh, just prior to me starting the war. So I, I still have about a year, a year and three quarters before I can tech up. So I am two techs behind. If I can get a couple really quick kills, I might be able to survive. But until that point, I'm in trouble. Okay, here come some armies. Not a lot of soldiers are coming this way, but... Okay, so 19th of July. Could we run away? No, we can't. We cannot run away. Let's see what we can do. For the love of God, hurry up. Actually, no, you should have the maneuver one, for God's sakes. That's a goddamn cannon. Let's go. At least we're getting some sieges here and there. And we're also getting a ticking war score, which is good. Okay. Are you the best possible general we could make? You suck. You suck really bad. Okay. A 3-4 is the best we can hope for. And that is a 5-5. Five five. Okay. Sweet. Okay. They just kind of teleport onto me. Okay, cool. We get to lose this fight. That's all right. And look at these forts. Look how long these forts have managed to outlast us. It's bullshit. Oh, boy. Now well, they get the minus one. That's something. Okay, so they do double our numbers. Um, fourth of August... We get a little bit of a while. Kind of equal, actually. Yeah, the tack difference is going to be problematic for us. There's really only so much I can do about that, though. I just can't believe how long these forts have held out. It's just actually kind of bullshit, frankly. And it makes me mad and filled with salt. Um, yeah. The war enthusiasm is starting to dip, though. Uh, unfortunately, they are, of course, going to... ...read soon. And there's their good general. Hurry up. Oh, God, here come the soldiers. Okay, um... Ow, 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 ow. I don't want it. Please leave me alone. Please stop harming me. God, 50 days till peace. Oh. I mean, the war has only been going on for... It's not even been going on a year. I just... I can't believe I've been on these forts for so long. Okay, that's... So currently we're actually winning the toss. Yeah, currently it's actually kind of even. Now it's somewhat less even. One. Okay, their morale's gonna go. Three, five. Okay, six, four, and three, five. I right, lost point six. They actually lost point five, so not great. Two, oh, five, oh. Make it there on the 7th of September, so not worth it. Let's retreat. Yeah, it pushed us to Kazan. We did lose about 18,000 men. I cannot actually believe how long these sieges are going on. This this game is bullshit, and I hate it. Come on. Seriously. Look at this. This is bullshit. I've been on these forts for nine months. I'm not actually going to get this now. Like, this is ridiculous. 85%. Come on. 
I swear, if they just walk into killing us, I, I don't even know. How long until they dipped? Okay, they're gonna be they're gonna dip into medium more enthusiasm soon. On. I have to get these sieges, please. Thank you. Holy shit. Oh my god, finally. Right, so they won't even white piece me. But they are at 28 enthusiasm, so... They're getting a lot closer to considering fucking off. Which is certainly a bonus. Okay. It's honestly really annoying how they just completely pieced out like pansies rather than joining the fight properly. Um, so I do obviously want to invade on them quite soon as well and take those territories. I might be able to get their war enthusiasm to dip quite low in a sec. Uh, one, two, three. Come on, lads. Get those sieges. Target pull. The hell? Oh, we try more south. That's why. Oh, no. We're going to lose the actual war goal. Ah, that's annoying. Nice six. My ships aren't going home, are they? No, they're not good. They're, they're still doing their job. Good, good, good. Okay. Wooden Shed, thank you for the follow, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Uh, la, la, la. That's the stuff. Good. All right, there's Moscow. I think... I think taking Moscow is soon as possible is a good idea. Let's stand here. Now we're reinforcing about 18,000 men at a time. We're looking okay. Could you do a quick time let's 1482? Quantum, what's up buddy? Um, uh, it's been a while. Yeah. What do you mean 1482? Yeah, this is... Look at that. I'm done pretty well, I think. It's just... Uh, it's the... These boys, they're causing me some problems. The date looked, the date looked different from the thumbnail. Oh, that was weird. That's weird. I could maybe try and get a couple easy wins, but it's not happening for a while. I might have to white piece. <sighs> really pisses me off, but I might have to. That really pissed me off. God, that would piss me off. Uh, what else could I get claims on? I can kind of get claims on all of this, really. Ooh. Great power. Boom. Great. Okay, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Just keep moving. As long as I never stop moving. I'll be fine. I have all the cannons that give me the max bonuses. I don't really have the manpower potential to be able to stop initial fights, so I do need to just kind of continue walking around siege and stuff. Okay. Oh, damn it. Ah, this cares. Come on. It looks like they're going to try and fight me. It's fine with me. 
Do I have cannons? Okay, so I do need to leave some cavalry behind. Oh shit, go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Everybody this way, let's go. Uh, they get there on the 20th, they get there on the 14th, so we have to hold on for a little while, but it is grasslands. And there are lots of more troops arriving, which is good. I mean, the problem, of course, is they do have like 200,000 soldiers. But we have lots of little sieges on them to try and put pressure. And it's going to take a while, but we're going to make it work, guys, okay? Here we go. Oh boy, I'm scared. Okay. Oh, look, they're attacking at a different time. 25th. Nice. It is a 5-5 general, of course. Warriors do not read books. What the fuck? Why would I get warriors do not read books? I'm... Uh, oh, it's because military tech is so far ahead. Yeah, that's fair. Okay, we've got this now. You know, relatively speaking. In like a relative sense, we have this. Or at least this individual fight. Okay, we won and we only lost like 4,000 soldiers. I really would like their war enthusiasm to go a bit lower. Great. Awesome. Get you guys over here, please. Oh my god, we got the Siege of Moscow. That makes a big difference. Okay. Give me the things I have claims on, please. I would love it if I could just take everything I had claims on. That's going to be almost impossible, but not entirely so. Ooh, because then I would get claims on the rest of Russia. God, I need to catch up on tech, though. This is ridiculous. Look at the number of sieges we have. Okay. Luckily, we have lots more infantry coming this way. Where else are we sieging? Let's go to Smolensk. All right, let's go. Nice. Now we're going to try and pick up the pieces. We're going to get small victories pretty much everywhere and pick up more war score. That is our goal right now. These guys are going to keep moving north. They're just going to keep grabbing individual sieges every time they goddamn see one. Go there. How many tech levels am I behind? I am behind a lot. I mean, yeah, about seven admin, five diplo, and now two mil, which is not good. Pretty freaking annoying, actually. My manpower isn't great. Russia is now only slightly getting back their manpower. But the thing is, is that I'm going to now start to give them war exhaustion. They are starting to get a teeny bit of war exhaustion. So, it's not much. Also, only in the provinces I'm sitting at. But if I can just continue to completely carpet siege their country, and if they start pushing into my country, it's going to make it so much easier. If they start piling into the east, this also just gives me more time to prepare to try and get tech 20. If I can get tech 20, I can win because infantry fire, an extra 0.1 pip on the infantry fire is so good. I'm at 1.1 right now. That gives me 1.6. Like, that's crazy good. 
My fire goes up massively. Also, the combat width. Yeah, I'm also on a billion corruption. Yes, this is also true. Okay. We need to start leaving behind some cavalries. Go. Start leaving behind these things. Wool disappearing. Oh god, our corruption events. Okay, and look at that. We're getting more and more just kind of random events that give us cash. These guys are rushing to try and get that nearest siege. Well, Novgorod is good. This is good too. Obviously, there's billions of people here we have to kill. Let's get this and go to Novgorod then with this. I, I I did I fixed it with bankruptcy once, but it came back basically. It's the short answer of this. Just gotta be careful and move kind of slowly. Oh my god, Sweden's been destroyed. The war enthusiasm is going to start hitting pretty low levels soon. Which is awesome. Okay. Bankruptcy helped a little bit, but it did not do much now. See what I can do about moving forward here. We're being careful, obviously. Very careful. But, we don't want to be too careful because we don't want to give up opportunities. Oh, baby. Got these forts. This is the thing. We have these forts. Obviously, they don't want to give me all of that. But if I, if I could take all that, I would then immediately... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I wouldn't need all of that, really. Um, I could take a few less. So maybe not Azov and stuff. Jesus, maybe not this one. My god, 23 dev. Holy shit. We can keep that. So we're only minus 142. Because if we could do that, then we could take this. Those two provinces. And that would be a sufficient number. Because I already have one. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Done. And then I have enough to take everything else. Wait, how many do I need? Because for the mission to pass... I know I keep checking this, sorry. Ten, at least ten provinces in the Pontic Steppe region. Okay. And the Pontic Steppe is there. So one, two, three, four, five, six. That's six. Seven, eight, nine. So three, six, nine. And then one more. So these lock. So everything up to there. And then one here. I only need one. Awesome. Suppose the one that's going to give me the most cash. Maybe the one that's orthodox, not Sunni. Okay. That's only minus 72. I'm, I don't mind boarding the Ottomans. I have the Mamluks as an ally. They can actually really help me out. Um, well, I also want to kill the Timmies. Being able to just chew up the Ottomans and spit them out would really help. Okay. This would give us a gigantic boost of power. We just have to not die. Uh, I know that seems a pretty significant part, but we'll see. Okay, where are they going? They are going to Kasimov, which means I need to not be here. We are now playing a game of cat and mouse, where I run away like a bitch every few seconds. The thing is, is I could do something really tricky here. I could try and just grab the war goal. They are now at three enthusiasm, because I am really messing them up. Need six for this. Three. Four. 
five, six. Right, the rest can come from everywhere else. Good. Okay, they are still trying to catch me a bit here. If we play this really smart, we can start to break them up. That. Yeah, like that. Okay. Oh, I'm taking this slow, but it's it's worth it. Okay. What else you got? Oh, I was sitting on my leg really badly there. All right, that's gonna be it for the episode, guys. Do be sure to like and comment the video. Like the series so far. I was out jogging, taking this with you for or bye bye.